But I'm heading back to Tokyo today. Welcome to part four of Meet the Parents. And no, Yoko will not be in this one. So if you want to see her, maybe she's going to be back in the next one. Let me see. If this one tanks, then I may have to bring her back. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I had a day to myself where I filmed this one. So this one's just going to be all me. If you want to see her, I know she's become the star of the show. She'll be back in the next episode. Anyway, if you've been watching one, two, and three... You'll know I flew to Tokyo, and then the next day I had to travel to Tochigi with Yoko to meet her parents. That's the whole point of this whole thing. Some of you may know, I spent a huge chunk of my life, 17 years actually, in Japan playing with an iconic band called Bees. So while I was in Japan, I had the good fortune to travel and play basically everywhere from the southern islands. Beautiful spot called Yadori, left point break. And all the way up north to the island of Hokkaido, which is the most northern island. And the very tip point of Hokkaido is called Wakanai, and it's about 40 miles across the strait to Russia. 40 miles due north is Russia. It's time to jump on a bullet train and let's head down to Tokyo and I'm going to show you some of my favorite spots. So I'm almost back in Tokyo and today's mission I'm going to go to Asakusa tour around. There's the sky tree. Almost there. Next stop. Before anything happens. We need a coffee. Just need to get my bearings. Take a little break, a little rest here. Made it to Asakusa. to get in here and get some smoke on me to give me good luck. Ready? Try this, so. <laughs> While I was on tour, especially if I was in Japan for long extended periods of time, days off, I would try and get the hell away from everything. I would go to a temple or a shrine or I'd go to the ocean just to try and bring myself back down to earth after playing these huge gargantuan shows. It's getting late, so let's head back to central Tokyo. We made it back to Daimon. I just walked from here. Minato-ku. This is Zojoji uh, Temple. I used to come here a lot. the old hood 
It all looks pretty much the same as it ever was. It hasn't changed a bit. But I'm gonna go see if my uh, my old favorite Indian restaurant's still here. I don't know if it's shut down in COVID or not. Surya, it's still here. Crazy. Hey. Sashiburi. <laughs> yep, this is my jam. There's a guy vacuuming in the station. Something you just would not see in America. And that, my friends, is a wrap. If you're still watching, thank you so much. I know I barely scratched the surface on all there is to see and do in Tokyo. It's a truly remarkable city. Japan as a whole is just a wonderful country, and I'd highly recommend you go there and see it for yourself. I think there's going to be another episode still to come, maybe two. So look forward to that. Look forward to seeing you in the next one. Until then, kush! My room is in shambles. I've only been here, I got here late last night. <laughs> it's like, dude, what, how do you? I don't know if you can hear the music they play. <laughs> it's the saddest, most depressing music ever. <laughs>